I'm just going to say that I learned something that I didn't know about, and I'm going to share it with you. So the secret is going to be out. Hey, Bolo Buddies. Thanks for watching. All right. This is one of my category videos. And all right, the secret's going to be out because I didn't know about it. Nobody ever told me about it. So I found it out through research and I'm going to share it with you. So let's get started here. We are today talking about Hallmark ornaments, but two things. Number one, I'm going to share with you the little secret I found out. But number two, I need you to wait until the end for more information on the little secret, okay? Because there's some information that you're going to need to know. All right, so let's start with the first one. And then as we progress, when I get to the secret, I'll tell you about it. It's not really a secret. It's just something I didn't know about. All right, so this is a Hallmark 2009 National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation Ornament. It's Cousin Eddie's RV. And I just want to tell you that in this video, there are Hallmark ornaments that went for over $1,000. So stay tuned for that. But this is the one that made me decide I want to do a video on Hallmark ornaments because I just, I know that if there's one that goes for hundreds of dollars, there's got to be others. And if I'm out at an estate sale or a garage sale, you guys, we see these boxed ornaments all the time. And what do we do? We pick them up if they're cheap. And if they're expensive, like three, four or five bucks, we probably walk past them. Well, these are some that you don't want to walk past if they are for sale for $5. Okay. <laughs> this one right here sold for $425. Now, a member of my Bolo Buddies Facebook group shared one of these that they sold. This is not their listing. This is another one, but it's Cousin Eddie's RV. This one is highly desirable and is a big money Bolo. It sold for $425, and you can see right here, I verified it with feedback, $425 for a Hallmark ornament. But wait, it gets better. This one here is a Hallmark Keepsake Ornament 2011 partridge and a pear tree event repaint. Do you see that last word? Repaint. What? What does that even mean? Well, event register to win repaint. So from what I'm gathering, these were very limited, meaning, um, see the box here? Here's the box. Here's the bird. See how they're different? So I guess this bird came in this box, but it says right here, repaint. It also, let me see if it says it on the back of this one. The repainted version of the first ornament in the 12 Days of Christmas series was issued in limited quantities and only available at the 2011 Keepsake Ornament Club event. So why is this special? It's special because there were only so many made. All right. So if you see the words repaint on a box on the front, on the back, you may have to read the back. It's not always on the front. Look it up. Now, again, wait until the end of the video because I have more information on this. This one sold for $455. Now, this one's a little bit interesting. Hallmark, a pony for Christmas ornament, repaint colorway. I'm not 100% on which ones were repainted. I think it's these front two because watch, look at the box. The box shows a white horse. See? So I think these were repainted. I do not think everything was repainted, but some of them were. And if you go down to the description, it does have additional information talking about the repaint colorway and which ones were just originals. So this one was a bundle and it sold for $484. And you can see right here is the feedback. All right, here it is on the back. Let's see. The repainted version of the 2013 Santa certified ornament was issued in limited quantities and only available at register to win 
at the 2013 Keepsake Ornament Club event. So again, artist crafted. This one right here is a choo-choo train. And here's the choo-choo train. But see, that one looks very similar to the box. So I don't fully understand the repaint. If anybody has any additional information, definitely let me know in the comments. Um, this was something I found by accident when I was researching. So I am still learning about this. But it is a 2013 Hallmark Santa certified event repaint. One of 64 mint in the box. $500. And there's your feedback. Verified. This one is a Hallmark 2011 Beauty of Birds Scarlet Ta uh, Tanager Special KOC Event. So KOC. This is a, an event repaint as well. 519. I will also say be on the lookout for these birds because some of them can do very well, even if they're not the repaints. And 519.99 on that one and verified with feedback. Here are the birds I'm talking about, okay? So I'm guessing most of these are not repaints. And this is a bundle. Now, you're thinking, all right, you just showed me a bird that went for like $500. This went for 28 of them went for 565. You could list these individually, maybe make more money. This person chose to lot them up and sell them all. If you could get 28 of these at an estate sale, let's just say they're like $25 takes them all. You would be thrilled with $565, right? So this one right here was a repaint sold for $519.99. Is that the same bird? It kind of looks like it, doesn't it? But I don't know if that one is a repaint. So it does make a difference. Look, original price $16.99. $565 on these. And there's your feedback. The next item is this Hallmark Frosty Friends first in series, a cool Yule 1980 for a true collector. Originally $6.50. <laughs> Tree trimmer collection. All right. It sold for $475 on best offer. This one is a Hallmark Keepsake Ornament Club Elegant Hummingbird repaint. So it's another repaint. 2017. I want them to show the bird, but they didn't. $599.95. Best offer was taken of $475 on the bird. Hallmark Frosty Friends Keepsake Christmas Ornament Lot. Now, one thing that would be tricky about this is if you find the bird not in the box. I don't know if there's a way to know if it's a repaint other than... Maybe Google Google Lens probably would be your best friend. If you guys don't know how to use Google Lens, I do have a video that teaches you. Type in Bolo Buddies Google Lens. It will be your best friend. It is a free reseller tool. Here's more of the Hallmark Frosty Friends Keepsake Ornaments 1980 through 83. These sold for $650. Aren't they cute? They are super cute. And... There is actually, um, is that the one they took a best offer of 550 on that one? Sorry about that. Hallmark Star Wars, Star Wars ornaments, exclusive Wrath of the Rancor, one of 1800, new in box 2013. There it is. This guy is a bow low. I kept seeing him over and over and over and over again. Star Wars, Star Trek, look them up. $7.25, best offer of $5.75 taken on this one. And what you do is you take the title. This one is actually correct on the feedback. I do appreciate that they're doing that, but it doesn't do it all the time. So you can take the title and you can go over to Terapeak and copy and paste the title into the search bar right here. And it is going to pull up what the item sold for. This is a rare Hallmark Christmas ornament. Curlin Associate Gift Christmas at Curlin's. Curlin's Associate Gift. 
So I don't know why this is so special. It's limited edition. Uh, it is a repaint right here. This repainted version, but they didn't even put repaint in the title on this one. But the people buying it, they knew, they knew. Wow. That's just incredible. Incredible. There it is. And this one sold for $1,999.99. This one is a 2016 Hallmark Maxine Star Track ornament. $2,000. <laughs> That's crazy. $2,000. And it does say convention exclusive. Sold for $2,000. Feedback was left. Star Trek. So I said Star Wars, Star Trek. 2011 Comic Con Glow in the Dark Star Trek USSS Defiant. Glow in the Dark. Special edition ornament is one of 700 issued for and only available at the 2011 New York Comic Con event. So again, it is a very special ornament. But looky here. Zero dollars. Wonder if it was a giveaway. Or if you got it if you went to the event. Anybody know? How many of you would have walked right past it? It sold for $2,900. And you can see right here, I verified that on Terrapeak as well. Now, let's take a look at some other repaints. So don't get too excited if you see repaint, all right? Because not all repaints are created equal. It is a very, very important thing to look for. But look, $1.29, $0.99, $5.00—these all say repaint. They all say repaint. Okay. So I hope you watch this far into the video so that you don't get tricked and see a repaint and get super excited. And it's one of these that only goes for $5 or less. It is important to still look the items up, but the ones that go for big money that are repaints go for big money. So let's look over here at some of the repaints that go for big money. Birds, 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 birds. This is a Lotus Fairy. This one is a Honeysuckle Mary's Angels, 30th. There's the train. Another bird, bird. Um, see, this one's unexpected. Seasons treating. And again, I'm not verifying all of these. This is just literally a repaint high to low search of solds. Here is a sweet pea repaint. There's another one of the angels, Mary's angels. So it looks like Mary's angels repaints do well. And that's just a mis mischievous kittens. And what I have learned from selling on whatnot is people love animal jewelry, especially cats. So this may have done well simply because it's a cat. And if you guys are not following me on whatnot, come on over. I sell jewelry. I do sell other things, but jewelry is my main focus right now. I do have a referral link down below where you can get $15 to shop when you join with that. And I would love to see you guys at a show. So come check it out. Here's another cat, mischievous kittens. So the kittens, the birds, this is a Snow Buddies. And these are repaints, guys. These are all repaints. So look them up. Look them up. All right. So let me know down in the comments, did you know about the repaint feature that makes some Hallmark ornaments a big money bolo? Let me know down in the comments. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching. This is a bolo category video. If you want to see more like this, I do have a whole playlist of big money bolo category videos. Thanks for watching.